Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're my eating, so social eating. And if it's your first time here, my name is Abby N. You can follow me on Instagram at Abby.n as well as on TikTok at Abby.n so yeah guys um i finally decided to come up with a sit down video i've been doing vlogs after vlogs so i was like why not turn things up and do a sit down video so yeah guys uh it is a sit down video welcome to my very first sit down video in a while in 2024 <laughs> so yeah guys um i'll be talking about aliexpress like a lot of people have been asking me how do you order from aliexpress are these scammers and whatnot so i'm gonna be covering everything you need to know about aliexpress so i wrote some of the points down so if you see me looking down i'll be referring to my notebook because i don't want to leave some important information so yeah guys and also i will be screen recording and all as well as screenshotting some of the things on the app so that you guys can see uh, how you do it and all that so yeah guys i would advise that if you want to order from aliexpress make sure that you download the app then sign in sign up yeah so basically aliexpress it is an online retail uh service based in china it is made up of like small businesses in china as well as some other locations such as singapore etc etc so you might wonder how you you order like um from different vendors so what you do you can like actually order from different vendors so what you do maybe for example uh you want to order a wig and you also want to order some makeup brushes so what you do you're gonna add both items to your cart and then pay for them at the same time so the difference is the delivery because the other item might take like maybe 30 days to arrive to your location and the other one might be like 60 to 75 days so they are going to ship on different times based on their location the type of shipping and all that so you're gonna receive your you're gonna receive your your packages in different times so yeah um shipping okay so with the shipping okay i've ordered like um four times yeah from aliexpress and uh, oh guys uh please excuse the background noise because like everyone is around so obviously they're talking and all that so please excuse that so yeah guys in terms of shipping um uh, they're gonna ship to your nearest post office so what you do when you you're gonna enter your address like your home address so what they do they're gonna locate the nearest uh post office to your address so you're gonna collect at the post office so there are some items that are free shipped and there are some items that you like have to pay for shipping so those that you have to pay for shipping they're gonna like arrive sooner than the ones that they are free shipped so if you pay shipping you're gonna receive your person like a week or two but if you don't pay for shipping you will have to wait even like two months a month or even three so if you do have money i would advise that pay for shipping so that you can like uh, receive your parcel earlier but another thing if you don't have money you want like a free shipped item uh just make sure that you you order in advance if you know that you're gonna need that uh particular thing that you're ordering in march just make sure by january you all do place your order so that by march that was 50 and also um regarding the post office issue when you go collect they're gonna you, you will have to pay for customs um it's around like the okay i've ordered uh four times at aliexpress and the first time the second and third i paid like a 32 32 and if not 35 rand. and the last uh parcel i received i paid like 700 and something so i think it depends on the value of what you ordered um the type of shipping and the vendor 
so yeah the last package i received was quite expensive like the customs so were quite high compared to the first three so yeah obviously you're gonna have to pay for customs depending on the value of what you ordered and the type of shipping so yeah guys and for me personally i had um challenges because um our post office in my location is very poor so what other post office normally do when as soon as they receive your package they're gonna give you a call but as for my post office in my location like the post office in my location they don't call you like you have to go there and check if it has arrived or not so but also you can also track via the post office site or via the aliexpress app you can track your parcel so yeah and then the they also do have the door-to-door -door delivery but i don't want to go into details about that because i've never experienced such i don't have more information about that so i don't wanna mm, talk much about that so yeah and then uh another point it's like a lot of people are scared to order from aliexpress because they think uh, aliexpress is scamming people and whatnot mm, it actually doesn't scam people i would say you need to play smart when ordering from aliexpress there are some vendors that are scammers there are some vendors that are not scammers so how to avoid vendors oh i mean how to avoid being scammed you need to read the reviews make sure that you read reviews and what i like about aliexpress they group like the reviews based on countries so just go under reviews of your country and hear what other people are saying so in that way you would know that okay it is safe to order from this vendor and also the numbers don't lie so always check how many people have ordered what you want to order so if like it's like a thousand or more you definitely know that uh, it is a great choice it is a safe place to place your order so yeah and another thing guys do not pay directly to the vendor if you want to order from a vendor and they tell you that uh you can send the money directly to us just know that they're scamming you make sure that you pay to aliexpress and then aliexpress is going to handle the payments to them and whatnot so just make sure that you don't pay directly to the vendor and then um how to find vendors there are different ways on how you can like find vendors number one you can always search there's a search uh button where you can like type anything that you want for an example um maybe you type kelly hair i'm gonna insert like a uh, screen recording to show you guys you're gonna type a kelly hair. they're gonna um, show all the kelly hairs that they have and all the vendors that they're selling kelly hair so you, you you can like choose from B and then the second um, option you can if you do have an image of what you're looking for just there's a camera thing I don't remember if it's on the top left or top right but there's a camera thing you can put on your image there and then they're gonna direct you to the to what you're looking for like exactly what you're looking for so it it is very easy it is very easy and convenient so yeah guys and also there is a refund like a lot of people are wondering if you order something will they refund you if you don't like the product the the product or if um yeah so they can always do refunds they do refunds but when you ship you have to like ship the what you ordered back but when you ship you will have to pay from a pocket which it will be very costly so some other people prefer selling whatever that they don't like so if you ordered something and you're not happy with it i'd suggest that just sell it rather than shipping it back because it is going to cost you more so yeah i'd advise that you you sell it to other people yeah and then guys i would advise you that please do not order 
things that you have to apply on your skin like skin care lotion skin care skin care things do not order that and also like something that you have to eat because you're not sure if it has been uh, tested and approved so make sure that you play away from that you can order your makeup brushes your your clothing your hair like there's a lot that you can order but do not play i'd advise that you do not play on things that you have to apply um, in your skin because we don't know if it has been proven or not so yeah guys and another thing that i like about aliexpress like the vendors always communicate with you if you buy something from them they'll always communicate with you in terms of like the shipping and all that they will like update you each and every day about your parcel and the checking and all that so that's convenient and why the hell am i leaving your heart okay and another thing that i like about aliexpress guys and if there's no amount like a minimum amount for shipping you can like actually order something for 50 rand and they'll definitely deliver it for you like you don't have to order maybe they don't like give you uh the minimum or the maximum of what you need to order so you can always order what you want if you want to order if you have like 50 rand and want to order things for 50 rand you can just place your order just like that so yeah guys it's 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 an interesting app uh, online shopping so just make sure that you try it out if you're scared um, of aliexpress like you can always buy cheaper things maybe makeup brushes like things that are affordable and see if they if you like it or not but for me like they've been good they've been good because I ordered like hair twice. I ordered like clothing and also like some shoes. And I was I was very happy. I was very happy. So yeah guys. And also guys stay away from ordering phones from AliExpress. Because you order an iPhone. And when it comes here. <laughs> it is a Samsung. So just make sure that you play away from things that are risky. Do not risk guys. Do not risk it just uh order something that is safe you know it is safe and yeah man so yeah guys i hope this video was very helpful if there's anything you want to ask or want to know you can like leave a comment down below i'll be there to answer you all you can send me a dm on instagram i'll be more than happy to assist you so yeah guys i know you're here because you definitely want to order from aliexpress so happy shopping i hope you enjoy the experience and yeah guys thank you so much for clicking in this video um i really really enjoyed uh, talking to you guys and yeah i'll see you in my next video definitely a vlog <laughs> and yeah guys i'll also do a hair review hair from aliexpress definitely i'm gonna do a hair review i don't know when but yeah i'm gonna do a re hair review so yeah guys i guess that it is that it is um i hope i didn't leave anything yeah i just hope i didn't leave anything out but i guess i covered everything so yeah guys i'll see you oh guys um when you 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 enter your address just make sure that you know what in in 30 days or in 75 days depending on when your delivery will arrive just know that you will be on that location if maybe you're a university student if you know that you'll be home by then just make sure you provide the home address but if you know you're going to be at varsity just give them the rest address or the university address so that they can locate you to the right um post office because the post office have like limited time they don't stay with your parcel forever they have like a limited um time so just make sure that you are at the location that they're gonna deliver your package so that you don't um 
have to miss it because if you do miss it they're gonna return it back so to avoid that just make sure you give the address of where will you where you will be by the time uh your person arrives so yeah guys i almost forgot about that so yeah